you love them very much and God knows your heart. Regardless if you show it or not. You've got love in your heart to those who love you. It doesn't matter if you show it or not. Beloved, sometimes when you don't show some people that you love them, they feel like as you don't care about them, you don't love them. You don't do certain things, uh, you know, for them. It feels like you don't care about them, you do not love them. But sometimes, beloved, some people might come towards you and you are not in that position at that moment to show them certain things in, in action. It doesn't mean that you are not with them spirit in the spirit. Or perhaps you do something for them once and you don't do it again. It doesn't mean that you don't you don't love them, you don't appreciate, you don't you don't care about them. And you might be one you might want to be attending to other situations and people are like kind of okay, why are you favoring somebody? Why are you you know focusing on someone? Why are you this? Why are you that? You don't care about us, you don't do this for us, you don't do this for us, don't do but they, they forgot to know that let's say you watch them, you see them, you know them, you understand, you feel for them, you love them. You love them equally, beloved, just as God loves us. We could do everything, but if we do not love in our heart, we are just empty. Someone could give to you, but you don't love you, they are empty. You, they, they are empty. Someone could talk to you and do you a favor, but if they don't love you in their heart, they are empty. Because sometimes someone might do something for you, and you take that to mean that they love you, but that's, it is, it is not, that's not love. People can't understand that love is from the heart. The fact that you are not talking, talking to some people doesn't mean that you, don't, you do not love them. You appreciate them in your heart. You know. But because they do not see your heart, they do not see that action, they feel that you do not love them. You, 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 you could only just do a, something at a given time. As God will lead. To somebody or to some people. Doesn't, if, the other, if other people don't, don't see that, that same amount of attention come to them. it doesn't mean that you don't care but you don't, you don't love them people want to be loved all at the same time which is so it, it people want to be shown love to at all at the same time it is it is it is not it's not easy it's not possible you could just only do your do your best and your, your best and allow the god allow god to do the rest some people feel like you do not love them you don't care about them you don't do this or that for them but god says to tell this moment that's going to put into your heart to understand that you love them regardless if you express that in, if physically or emotionally or not. God says he's putting your, your love, he's opening people's eyes to see that you care about them a lot. That you show love to them. That you show love to them. You love them. I also myself, this moment, I have to say I love you also very much. I love you. I might not express this love towards you physically or in another manner, but I love you. I love all those of you watching me. I love those of you following me. I love those of you supporting me. I love all of you because if you don't love me, you will not support me. If you don't care about me, you will not support me. You will not even be annoyed with me in the first place. So I appreciate all those of you who are annoyed or who are, who are, who are grieving us because they feel that I'm not showing them love. I love you all so much. I want to sit, stand to tell that I love you all so very, very much. Glory be to God. I might do some things for you. But if I don't love you, I am nothing. First Corinthians 13 verse 3 to 7. If I give everything I own to the poor and even, even go to the stick to be bound as a martyr, but I do not love, I have gotten nowhere. So no matter what I say, what I believe and what I do, I am bankrupt without love. Love never gives up. Love cares more for others than self. You care for others than your own self. If you like, you move mountains, you do all kinds of things, give charity, and, and sing someone's praises, and do all kinds of things, but without, if you don't have love in your heart, you are like an empty symbol, you are like an empty vessel. But God says, this now you're not an empty vessel, you love. God knows your heart. God sees your heart. God feels your heart. I'm saying this from for, for for like I'm saying this like an experience. I love a lot, but people don't get it. Please tell me how do I want to love you? <laughs> how do you want me to love you? I love you. I see you. I appreciate you a lot. The fact that I don't show it or I don't do certain things doesn't mean I don't love you. 
all of you, if you are watching me this, this moment, if you are listening to this video, listen to this, this moment, I want to tell them I love you. I might not show it the way you want. I might not show it in a physical in whatever manner, but in my heart, I love, I cherish you. I, I appreciate you. I appreciate your giving. I appreciate your love. I appreciate all what you've been doing, your comments, your subscription. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. Thank you. You are so loved. You are so blessed. God has given us, given his son to us because he loved us. If he, if he didn't love us, he won't give his son to us. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have an everlasting life. We are bonded in Christ. We are together in Christ. God has really given his love to us. And his love in us, he shall have no matter how we try to resist it. No matter how some of you may, may want to resist loving me. You can't, you can't help but love me because the love of God is in your heart. And it's hard to take away the love of God in your heart because it's special and brought in your heart. We are bonded in love in Christ. God has, Christ has, God has really given his son for us because he loved us. Christ came as that mediator for us to bond in him. We are all in Christ. We love. Christ is love. We are connected in Christ. No matter how I try to hate my brother or my sister, I can't because I just love. This is the season of love. Glory be to God. Love between friends, relatives, spouses, uh, acquaintances. There's love in the air this moment. God knows your heart. God indeed knows your heart. Let love continue to lead. Let love continue to lead. I love you so much. Thank you for being here. God bless you. And see you in the next video.